Hey collective, what's going on y'all? So I'm back with another energy read. I see I'm looking down because I already got some cards out here on the table. I was doing to read it and then it said that um I ran out of storage or whatever like that. So yeah. Okay. Um so the crazy thing is the three cards that the first three cards that came out was put magic on your mother. It's happening for a reason and impact. So whoever you are, um, your mother can no longer be here with us. Sorry for my condolences. I too lost my mother. But um, something happened for a reason, okay? I'm getting like your family put some sort of magic on your mother to keep some sort of secret from being revealed, okay? If this could have happened, um, you know, while you were pregnant or something significant could have happened while you were pregnant um your mom could have passed away while you was pregnant or you could have had a premonition of you know something happening you know while you was pregnant i feel like it was some sort of with this recovering from magic i feel like it was some sort of magic put on you too the same magic that they used to try to take out your mom they tried to take you out with the same thing after they realized that you were on to what it was that they was doing yeah with this i am fearless you started peeping shit you started seeing shit you like nah something is not right i'm also getting this it could have been something significant about um like the funeral arrangements like i feel like whoever whoever took because i see it here you got choose your battles wisely but these are the cards that already came out y'all i'm telling you they didn't want me to get this message out so it's like say choose your battles wisely so it's like you don't even have to go and do nothing to these people but some somebody did forge your signature on something on something look you got forged documents and stole your documents so not only did these people steal your documents they forged something on it Okay, they could have forged your name on it, forged your signature to try to get something that was meant for you. Okay, and it's like these people could have... I'm also getting something about like a wash check. So like say you signed something, um, they could have washed something and put your signature on what really needed to be signed. Like they didn't bring... For some of y'all, two, 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 one o'clock, they could have, you know, had you under some sort of illusion, been putting something in your food where you were sick and then they, uh, they asked you to sign something and said it was for something else. Yeah, this was you signing something over you know what i'm saying you ain't even know you signed some shit over that was was meant for you but now these people are facing legal issues because i feel like something is came coming out i feel like whoever you are because you were fearless and you started speaking on some shit that like i'm getting like speaking on some shit like you may have not even really understood what you were speaking on but it's like your ancestors was just guiding you yeah it says i want to keep the promises i made to you i feel like this is your past on loved one this could be your mother but it's like she's going to keep the promises that she made to you it was something that maybe y'all discussed or spoke about before she passed on before she transitioned and it's like she wants you to know okay your mother is definitely putting her foot down her foot on motherfuckers necks and letting them know what's going on because i feel like yeah with this study in tarot this this could be you know what i'm saying you could be studying tarot but i'm getting like you're getting a lot of um um confirmations through terror right now yes i feel like it's a lot of bad memories yeah you got daydream and visualize as above so below he she wish they put you first it could also be something dealing with a biological father i feel like it's a lot of stuff that was hidden that you did not know that these people were lying and saying and speaking on you okay But yeah, let's see. I want to see what's this put magic on your mother. Because it's a reason. Like, I'm telling y'all, like, if I could really one day, like, uh, Aries Leo Sagittarius got something to do with this. One day, y'all. Because if I told y'all, like, the details of how I just seen things and how everything came into play, it was just, like, weird. You know what I'm saying? And you know what's crazy? Because I was thinking about it earlier. I always get like this around this time. But I was just like thinking about it earlier this morning. Probably like six something this morning. I was just like thinking about my fucking uncle. I'm like, how he gonna call me and tell me my motherfucker passed away? Like, out of all people, you the one who gonna call me crying and talking about some old oh, my sister died, my sister died. Nigga, we ain't speak to you in how fucking long before him. My mother took care of you four, four, four o'clock. My mother took care of you damn near your whole bed. You ain't come see that lady, not nothing when you came home. And then you, out of all people, wanna fucking call my phone crying and talking about your sister? Like, get off my fucking, like, yo, you know how certain things happen? 
happen like a situation like that like you know death whether it's birth or death you never forget certain things and that, I, that that's something that really stick with me because it's like why would you call me like what what in your mind said oh let me let me be the one to call y'all all was in that hospital so y'all all already knew what the fuck was going on it's crazy because i was the only one that wasn't there that's so crazy but these people gonna get their shit for what they did simple as that and i feel like whoever you are you're under some sort of neighborhood watch you got everybody watching when i tell you i went to the store it was when i was thinking about this it was like six something this morning as soon as I go down, it's like you hear people looking at their people, looking out their people. My daughter be like, oh, why are you looking out your people? Because they be looking out theirs. The fuck? If you looking at me, I'm going to look at you. We're going we gonna to both have this same uncomfortable understanding that you're not going to do shit to me that you don't want me to do back to you. Simple as that. The fuck? Look, seven of pinnacles. It's like, I'm telling you, these people were so invested too. They were so invested in trying to come for you. This is a sibling. With this son of Nas, if you got this deck, this is this is a sibling, a brother coming after another brother. So it could be two brothers or it could be two sisters. It could be a brother and a sister. Take it where it resonates. But it was something over some fucking money. Okay? And I'm getting like, like I said, your mother could have mentioned something. Because it's like, well, why they put magic on, on the mother anyway, spirit? Please and thank you. Like, what, what caused them to even do that? Look, seven of baskets. To create some sort of illusion. Illusion around a situation that they was causing behind the scenes. Yeah. Wheel of Fortune. Six of Wands. I'm getting like, it don't even really matter why they did what they did. Because things is turning out in your favor, collective. Look. With the fool, it's something going on in a courthouse too. A court system. These people, like. Because like, whatever they did, whatever money they signed. Or whatever they did, like, Empress. You never had nothing to do with that. You never... Sign no papers. You know what I'm saying? If you did something. But it's like you never handle nothing legal to where it's like these people see your name. These people could have even been going. And I picked this up sometime last year when I said somebody had an ID with your, pick, with your name and shit on it. With your information, your name, your date of birth, your address. But with their picture, a real like doppelganger type shit. Somebody went to the extreme and they really thought that it was never going to come out. I don't know that's scary i would be scared to even do that I, I don't know jail not for me and i feel like this is somebody who always talk about jail ain't for them and they did some shit to get them caught right up in fucking jail because where that's where the fuck you about to go doing some shit like that like what was you thinking ten of swords what was you thinking money that's all it was about because i seen that mother coin that's all this person that's the only thing they saw and they signed i'm telling you it was elite aries leo sagittarius with this mother wanted i mean with the mother six this bitch like that's all she saw was dollar signs like on some mr crab shit me money me money that's all she saw and it's like this is this is where you get this is what gets you okay yeah eight of wands three of pinnacles started working fast too this bitch was working fast. Then I tell you, that funeral was so fucking fast. I never seen a funeral so fast in my life. I never seen like the whole like the whole setup. Everything it just went so fast. Like it was no it was no time to really grieve. Nothing. It was just like boom, boom, boom. And when I say like the, when if we like I said we ain't gonna even speak numbers, but these bitches like my mother worked. You feel what I'm saying? Six of coin. My mother worked. So giving little, I'm telling you, full coin, giving chunk change and pocketing some shit and then stealing some shit on top of that, like, hell fucking no. We not doing that. Y'all dead ass wrong. Tower. Y'all dead wrong. <clears throat> Had all these people working and working and working just to try to stop you from getting something that's meant for you. I'm also getting something about a father. Like it's something about your father. Your I don't know. I don't know where we what, what, what role he playing is. What else? That's crazy because I seen the father Sims. Yeah, his balance is gonna come. I'm telling you, these people is liars. Liars, okay? But I feel like whoever you are, you stand in your ground, okay? I feel like the messages is coming through and you revealing that shit. These people is watching you stand up for yourself too. The same way these motherfuckers sitting here lying, they know that what you saying is the truth. 
That's why they got their tail tucked between their legs because they know what they did behind the scenes. They know what they did. Like, I'm telling you, take your mother out for some money. Take your sister out for some money. Take your aunt out for some money. That's crazy. 10, 10 on the clock. That's crazy. Something is significant about a kitchen. Something could be hidden in the kitchen. Something could be hidden in the basement. And that's crazy how I had them upside down. So, yeah. These people was also moving shit around. 10, 25 people was moving shit around. Yeah, believing doesn't require proof. Okay? You don't pick and choose. You keep the same energy. That's what I'm saying. It's like you're not playing with these people. It's like any, any, y'all all gonna get, it's like everybody gonna get their shit one by one. One by one. It's like you don't need proof to know what the fuck you know. Yeah, identity crisis. These people is going through it. They don't know who the fuck they are. Because they know they being revealed. Yeah, you got black hog and cosmetic surgery. People also trying to get surgery to look like you. They want to look like you. Yeah, you got to feel like they owe, feel like you owe them something. Be worried when they say nothing. I'm telling you, these people talk about you nonstop. The first shall be last and the last shall be first and immortal. See, this was them trying to take you out. But you recover from that magic. The same magic. I don't know. I can't even tell you why. Like you know, It was just meant. I guess maybe, you know, when... Um, one going the next one born so it's like your mom passing away but it was a new life coming into fruition anyway you know what i'm saying especially if you was pregnant around that time but i'm getting like when, even when they did try to take you out i was like you're immortal they know that because the same shit that they did i'm getting like the amount that they gave your mom didn't even compare to the amount that they gave you and you still standing here today so just know thank god thank god like yeah you have an armor of protection around you the protection is fucking real these people is about to be like i'm getting like somewhere armed like solitary confinement okay these people is going down you don't do no shit like that y'all gonna get y'all shit y'all gonna get y'all shit yeah they saying it's bigger than me and you that's what your ancestors is letting you know like it's bigger than me and you it says if you know you know and free will See, these people had the free will to do what they wanted to do. I'm also getting like, your mom used her free will, you know? Like, it was something about being sacrificed. I feel like your mother knew that. Your mom knew that it was something about being sacrificed. Like I said, it was something that she asked for once you got once you got pregnant. It was something that your mother asked for. I don't know if it was some sort of information. I don't know if what, what it was. Okay? Your mother could have ended up on drugs. Like, it could have been something. Look, I'm telling you, it was something about some money. And then this, cat, this catfish-ass bitch went right behind you pretending to be you to try to get something. Let me see. Hold on. I'm going to use these. Let's see. But definitely over some money. I feel like whoever you are, you're growing from this situation, though. Yeah, life purpose. I feel like you're growing from this. this is, I feel like whatever this is, it's allowing you to grow. I do feel like maybe like you feel as if, you know, certain things, um, like if your mama isn't here, like, yeah, I feel like whoever you are, you be in your emotions a lot. But it's almost like if, 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 like, if your mom didn't pass away or if all of that didn't happen, would you be where you are today? Would you be as strong as you are today? Would you be as independent as you are today? So it's just, you know, you got to look at the light. You know, you know, you got to look at the lighter side of the situation, for real, for real. But I do feel like it's a lot of signs and symbols coming from, from the universe and letting you know that things are going to be okay. Also letting you know that some sort of money is coming through for you. Simple as that simple as that look i'm telling you these people is getting arrested you don't do no shit like that they time is coming don't even worry access denied i feel like you could be blocking communication from these people or spirit is telling you to just block communication from these people yeah they coming through to apologize though i'm also getting something about the last rodeo look i'm telling you toxic family tarot reading and um angel numbers so i feel like a lot of angel numbers is surrounding and protecting you communicating with you you could read tarot Especially if you read tarot. But this family, I'm telling you, they they fucked up. There's going to be a few of them behind bars. Don't even work. A few of them. A few of them. And this is that sex, selling sex. Somebody also could be trying to sell sex for, like, try to get by or make a living 1444 on the clock. I'm also getting that somebody could have been saying that you sell sex and whole time you just fucking sit around and read tarot and take care of your business, take care of what you got to take care of. 
I mean, like, after these people did, yeah, childish. It's like after they did what they did, it's child, like they tried to justify what they did by talking about what you do. Like, what the fuck I do got to do with what you did to me? What? Please tell me. One thing ain't got shit to do with the other. Yeah, the grass is green because it was fake. These people is fake as fuck. And they scared. And they have some sort of sick obsession with you. Because you're not scared. Because you're fearless, okay? It's like you're not fearing a motherfucking thing. These people want you to fear your gifts or fear, fear the unknown. For what? What are you? What is that gonna get you? Ain't, ain't no need to fear nothing. There's no need to fear nothing. But let me get some from this um, hidden truth oracle because you definitely have a past on loved one who loves you deeply. Your mom loves you deeply. I don't. Is it these? I don't think it's these, it's the other ones. Yeah, message of closure. These are the ones I wanted. Let's get to. Yeah, it says, I am sorry I left while you were young. So you could have lost your mom, like, um, you know, young. You know what I'm saying? You were still young. You still had time. I feel like you still had time to learn and grow. 16, 16 on the clock. But let's get some messages from this mom. Because, like, it's like, I feel like. She knew, I'm getting like, I'm, I keep getting like sacrificial lamb. She, she knew what was going to happen. She knew what was going to happen. It says, do you feel my touch? And it says, I'm, I miss our morning coffee. So your mom could have been a type to drink a lot of coffee. But she, she's letting you know that this is a, this year that she's around you. It says, I know this isn't fair. So she know that what was done was not fair. Yeah, she said, please take care of yourself. She know what was done wasn't fair. To you or to her. Look, it said, it makes me so happy to see you heal. So the fact that you continue to move on and persevere, even, you know, without her being here, it, it makes her smile. It makes her happy. It really do. It says, do you want me around? So I feel like because it could have been some things that were left unsaid. Yeah, it says I, I was wrong and I'm sorry. Because it was some things that was left unsaid and it kind of left you in the dark about a lot of shit. And this is why these people was even able to do what they did to you to begin with. It's like she's letting you know like she's sorry. And that like, do you want her around? Do you want her to, you know, visit you, see you, okay? So if you do, yeah, it says I am healing you now. So it's like she's helping you now get through whatever this is. I feel like your mom is more of a help for you. Yeah, it says I'm more than, a, than my Instagram profile. So people look at you like, um, so I'm here on commodity. I don't even know what that means right now. But it's like a hot commodity. Somebody looks at you as if, oh, like you hot topic because you're on social media or something like that. They don't know you feel this shit in your veins. Like like you get chills behind the shit you do. It ain't got nothing to do with being on no social media and getting no, no sort of buzz. Like when you feel this shit in your heart, you don't give a fuck about a social media. Okay, but this person, your mother's want you to know that she loves you. It says I love you. This person, this, like, your mom, I don't know. I'm getting your mom, so I'm going to just stick with that. But it's like, it, it was a lot of things that was left unsaid. And this is why these things was even happening, okay? Like, it was, like I said, it was a, it was a barrier in the trust. Um, and that's why they did Your mom felt the need to not tell you certain things. Yeah, it says, I didn't know how to comfort you. Because I'm telling you, when I told my mother that I dream... It was like she didn't know what to say, but it's like it, like a part of me knew that she knew something else behind what it was that I was saying to her. You know what I'm saying? Yes, yeah, I am with my I'm with our ancestors now. So she's like, you know, like she's safe, she's good. Look, yes, I heard you. I'm sorry I criticized you. I support your path. So this person could have been like, um, yeah, it says thank you for making amends. So I feel like whoever you are. Look, I know you have trouble trusting. Wow. <clears throat> this person is um, helping you now, but they, they're saying, your mom is saying that they, she's thankful that you forgave her for whatever it was that was going on. Because I feel like whoever you are, you were very gifted, very spiritual from young. Okay? Like, maybe this is something that you inherited, you know, from another side. I don't know if your mom was spiritually gifted like you or, you know, had, like, whatever the situation was. But maybe they did not... They criticized you, okay, for the decisions that you made, for the things that you said. Like, you were definitely a black sheep, even, like, 
even when i'm also getting like it was something about like maybe your mom was gifted but she feared the gifts so she never tapped in and then it's like when she realized that you were gifted she sh like either shunned you away or like just ignored it like you know she just ignored it and uh, the more you ignore something you know it'll go away like if you ignore your gifts and you and you're not um exercising them they will leave well not leave but they will play in the background you have to strengthen them up again and i feel like that's what you had to do okay but it's like this but she's supporting your path if you're wondering like oh i read tarot or whatever the situation is um do this person support me they do okay like i feel like your mother wishes she was as strong as you are now but it, it's something about like everything really happening for a reason yeah i'm seeing it again i'm I'm sorry i left while you were so young i didn't mean what i said so this person could you know yeah it says you are you can break generational patterns look it said i care too much about others opinions i am so proud of you see like i said your mom was just as spiritually gifted as you but she cared about what people said too much whereas you don't give a fuck <laughs> you don't care it is like i feel like your mom could have always admired you for that even when it came to you and her going through your sparrows it was like you always was opinionated and you stood on how you felt and it was like can't nobody like how you what's the word i'm looking for because i'm getting so emotional but it's like you were never the type to just let like oh somebody said this so i'm going with them it's like you always stood up for yourself like and you know maybe it, it came off so tough because it's like after a while people was just so hard on you so it was like you started being hard back but it said this person cared too much what other people said and like i said they could have shunned you you know what I'm saying? When you started opening up to your gifts or started letting them know what was going on. But it's like this person is letting you know that they do support your path. Okay? And that you can break generational curses. Like, this person is very proud of you. Like I said, they didn't have the the willpower that you had to, to you know, do what it is that you're doing. Okay? It's like you're the one who's breaking these generational curses. And like I said, these people know that because the same magic they put on your mother... They put that same shit on you. It just did not work. It did not work. And they getting their shit. I'm telling you, look, it says 555, unexpected change. Thank you. Okay, so it's like give thanks to your ancestors. I'm also seeing your daily affirmations. I feel like whoever you are, you're extremely blessed. I said blessed and protected. So you're extremely, I meant this, I say plus, But I meant to say blessed and protected. Okay, so yes. I feel like your blessings are protected as well. I'm telling you, something is coming full circle. These people who did what they did, they're not it was they not getting away with it. They not getting away with it. Trust the process. It says change your you are's to I am. So it's like, yes, yeah, speak as if you know what you're talking about. Like that's that's that daily affirmations as well. Look, it says divine time and everything happened when it should. I feel like whoever you are, you're breaking major major generational curses like major like for real for real like it's it, it's like <laughs> like your great great you know what i'm saying grandmother was going through the same shit you were like oh hell no you was going through it Ma going through it grandma going through it. hell no 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 that shit stop right here okay so let me get a few of these and then we gonna close it out but this person is extremely proud of you. Like, whatever your family did, your bum-ass family, they're going to get their shit for that. Look, they're going to be, it's, it's forgiveness. You know what I'm saying? Forgiveness. It's an acknowledge that harboring resentment blocks the flow of love. So forgive these people. You know, it's going to be hard. It, it really is going to be hard. Because I'm telling you, this morning, I was like, yo, I, I, I still feel it, like, as if it was today. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, why does man call my phone? Like, you know, I, I don't know. I'm just like, I would never forget that. Like, I would never forget who was the one to tell me that my mom passed away. And then it's like, you, I, I know, my. I, I remember when my mother cried to me. She was like, I don't understand why my brother don't speak to me. Why he don't come see me. My mother was in tears. And for you to be the one to pick up the fucking phone and tell me that she not here. Like, what? 
you don't have that right like so it'd be like certain stuff still fuck with me but it's like it's all about forgiveness you know what i'm saying because these people gonna come and ask for forgiveness they gonna have no choice but to they're not gonna have no choice but to for real for real like i'm telling you healthy as fuck like it was no way bro no way but it's like just take care of your health for real health it says i will honor the physical vessel that insurance my soul so it's like just taking care of yourself doing whatever it is you got to do to take care of yourself okay so that way can't nobody say oh it was this or it was that like make sure you good it says relationships i am attracted to people who serve my higher good yeah i feel like you have a lot of new things coming your way a lot of new bonds a lot of new i'm also getting like it's gonna be people that is going to how you call it connect with you on such a more deeper scale okay like on a deeper deeper scale for real for real but yeah these people the guilt the guilt behind what they did is eating them up alive look i'm telling you and then you got fear fear because they know it's like what you scared of how you <laughs> i don't know yo I really don't know, but like I said, the, the guilt and the fear is eating these people alive for what they did because it's like, mm-mm. So that's the message that I have for you all, and until next time.